Good evening, everybody. Thanks for joining us on TCM. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. It's our last night showcasing the films of the alluring, talented, and mysterious Kim Novak, our star of the month. Our next movie gave Novak an opportunity to play a challenging, dramatic character from an acclaimed tragic love story by W. Somerset Maugham. From 1964, it's Of Human Bondage. Set in Edwardian England, it's the story of a well-to-do young medical student with a club foot who falls obsessively in love with a cockney waitress. Unfortunately, the waitress is only interested in using him and his money, leading to tragedy and heartbreak for both of them and tears for everyone watching. Novak stars as the coarse, restless waitress with Lawrence Harvey as the forlorn med student. The story was first brought to the big screen in 1934 with Betty Davis and Leslie Howard in the leads. Then in 1946, Eleanor Parker and Paul Henry took a turn at the material. This third version of Mom's story was troubled right from the start with two directors abandoning the project. It began with Henry Hathaway, a director noted for his westerns. When Hathaway quit, screenwriter Brian Forbes tried his hand at directing his own work, but it proved too much for him. He does have a cameo appearance in the film, though. Finally, director Ken Hughes finished the film. In addition to the directorial merry-go-round, there were rumors that the film's stars, Novak and Harvey, did not get along well. Novak had a history of feuding with their leading men, William Holden, Tyrone Power, and Kirk Douglas, to name a few. If there was tension between the stars, at least Harvey could find comfort in knowing he was in good company. From 1964, here's Kim Novak and Lawrence Harvey in Of Human Bondage. 